And we're here with some early Crazy 8s against High Rollers, some D4 action here. This is going to be an extra game that was not on the stream schedule, but we're going to be able to get to today. So thank you for joining. Uh, this is Joe Shea going to cast this, possibly joined by Jess or someone else. We're going to play it by ear right now. <clears throat> Face off one by the High Rollers. Dimitri has looks to make a play. Nice four check by Sam, picked off by Aaron. Shot broken up by Dimitri. Ball thrown across. John Chick has it. Looks to alley oop it up. Kept in. I believe that's Josh. Aaron picks it up. Looks to make a play, but that's going to be contested by Sam, who's putting a nice little check on there. She picks it up. Dimitri gets it. We got a two on one forming, but it's going to be cleared out by Kelly M. Carolyn has it. Chips it up to Dimitri. Dimitri handles over to Brian. Brian does not have the handles right now. Tam's in the house. Stitcher throws it over to John Chick. Nice battle down there. Sam has it. Nice breakout pass to Dimitri. Dimitri to Brian. We got a two-on-two -two forming. Brian turns shot. Big rebound. Huge save right there by Pete Lang. Brian looking to make a play here. That ball's loose. Aaron's going to pick it up. Looks to make a move. Sam gets it, tries to clear it, unable to do so. Second attempt to clear it, it is out. Aaron Brown looking to gain the zone, but Carolyn's gonna chip this one up to Dimitri. Dimitri's gonna throw it up to Brian. Sale struggling with his stick there. Brian turns shot, that hits Kellyanne in the back of the leg, that will leave a mark. Oh, great clear up there to Sharon. Sharon looking to break it out, she's gonna throw it in deep. Mark Tebow throws it across to Carolyn, throws it across to Sam. Sam pass, oh, that hits. Tries to hit Drew. Drew just did not have a stick on it right there. Unfortunate. Aubrey Keach makes a play, though. Keeps it in for high rollers. Chips in. That's going to go on net. Now will be frozen. What's up? Right. Um, we got to figure out what place to get water from the um, pizza place. See if I'll fill it up. And we gotta, I got to get my stuff. Face off one back there. Allison Rapp's gonna keep this one in. Chips it over to Aubrey. <clears throat> that ball goes out. Mark th throws it all the way in. And that's gonna be an ice right there. Yeah, we got all this stuff out because next game is, I got a ref, right? I, I gotta play, I gotta play, yeah. So maybe can you do third? Yeah, I can do all the third. All right, yeah, then I'm gonna be time. I, then I can grab the um, goalie stuff. Get situated. Big face off here. Alec tries to win it. Becca's gonna get it. Becca turns shot. That's blocked. Melissa tries to get it out. Uh, Sale's gonna be there to, to prevent it. Sheik is in the house. How you doing, Sheik? That ball's thrown in. Melissa's gonna gather it up. Nice four check by Frank, who scored in the previous game for Gwendolyn. I believe Gwendolyn secured a first seed in rec with that win against uh, Thrashing Pumpkins, 3-1. That ball ends up on Sharon Six. Sharon tries to get by Allison Rapp, but Allison Rapp will have none of that. <clears throat> Alec chips it in, and watch the speed. Teal is in the house, all the, in the house, but not actually in the, the, the Michael and Sons house. That ball is still in right now. Becca's gonna gather this one up. Thrown in. Looks like Looks like it's going to be offsides on yellow right there. Crazy day at the Sportsplex as apparently it was double booked and games started an hour late. So we're going to catch up as best as we can right now. Aaron's going to pick this one up for Crazy H. Throws it in on net. Stitcher's going to let it go wide. Oh, Sheik's do, always doing I'm doing all right, you know. Had a bit of a water spill on the car ride, but you know, I think we'll live. There's more than enough water in the uh, in the world for me, I hope. Centering pass broken up right now. Is that Dennis the Menace looking to make a play here? Clears his own. That is Dennis right now playing out. Watch him to score a goal today, as he always scores goals. Sam throws it up to Austin. Little misconnection right there. Dennis gets it, throws it in deep. Pitch forked out by Kellyanne. Austin has it, looking to do something with it. That ball is still in. Shoutouts to Austin Keach for wearing 
The, the same kind of uh, shorts with the neon, uh, neon yellow slash green there, so we always know when he's out. Josh throws it up right there. Chip in. We got Sarah Schenk who dumps it in deep. John Chick. Hatless John Chick. We're going to try to find out in intermission why he's not wearing a hat right now. Aaron tries to pass, broken up by Austin. Austin tries to chip it in and does. That's going to be frozen by Pete Lang and Dennis with a strong pressure right there. We'll give an offensive zone draw here for the high rollers. <clears throat> you okay? Frustrated me. I'm just sick of that high behind. Alex gonna win this draw. Josh has it, looks to pitch. Oh, that's, that's not Alex, that's Sam. Sam won it. Whoops. Brian turns shot, just missed the net. Dimitri turns shot, saved by Pete, net is frozen. That's what's happening, and it's like, I wanna have not have to play. Dimitri wins it to Brian, back to Eric. Broken up by Frank. Nice play on Frank's part. Mark's going to win this ball. Throws it around, but hits the net, so unlucky bounce there. Frank with a strong four check right here. That ball's out. You get Brian moving. Josh is able to keep it in, though. Dimitri picks it up. Three on two, Foreman. Dimitri beats Becca, carries it in. Look, look for the cut. Sam breaks it up. Shot on that. That ball's still loose, though. <clears throat> Brian tries to get it to Dimitri, unable to do so. Brian does get to Dimitri in the slot. Big shot, goal, Dimitri. Huge pass by Brian, hit Dimitri right on the tape. That's the value of a tape to tape pass right there as Dimitri was able to just let that go. Huge goal, high rollers, one nothing here. Seven and a half left in the first. Such a huge goal for high rollers right now as they're gonna take the lead right now. Can we pull up standings right now and see? We're gonna pull up standings and see um, where this game stands. Turnover. Brian has it. Carries it around. Hits Dimitri again. Nice shot. Just steered wide. Sale's gonna try to dump it up. Sale hits it to Alec. Alec full head of steam right now. For some reason, decides to throw it in Sarah's feet. Sarah's gonna throw it in deep though. So we're gonna see what the, this game is gonna do for the D4 standings right now. <clears throat> So crazy, it's high rollers, they are tied right now. So we've got, um, that's, that's a big keep in right there by Alec. Nice pass across to Aaron. Aaron shot. That ball's loose. Stitcher thought he had it, but was incorrect on that one. The ball's thrown off Drew, but Austin, um, excuse me, Aubrey's got a huge head of steam right there trying to win this. Him and Drew gonna battle for it, trying to pick Sale's pocket. And they do. Drew ends up with it, tries to centering pass, unable to do so. So based on standings right now, the winner of this ha will get the fourth seed. Oh, nice wraparound by Drew. Is that in? <clears throat> we were unable to see it, but it looks like it might have gone in. So They could potentially get the third yes. seed if Stick Magnets yes. lose. Yeah, so the, the winner of this game will be the fourth seed. They could potentially be the third if Stig Magnets lose to Shangri-La. So th this game will... Um, this game will not necessarily impact. Look, it's going to be goal high rollers. That'll be two nothing. So yeah, this this will be a big deal if um if uh, Stick Magnus end up losing to Shangri La. Dennis looking to make a play here. Turn shot. Dennis is playing out. Aaron Brown looking to make a play. Nice D by John. That goes on Sharon Stick. Sharon tries to throw it in deep. Kick by Austin. John's gonna get there, try to reset. Tries to pitch fork it out. Becca gets it, she's gonna throw it back in, but Aaron Brown's gotta to touch up. Sale gets it, throws it up to Aaron right now. Three on two forming, Aaron to Alec. Alec using his feet, turns. Shot goes off Carolyn's foot, but that ball's still loose. And that is gonna be frozen by Stitch. So we have so many games on tap today. It's going to be exciting. We're going to stream as many as we can as the last week of the regular season. A lot of these games matter for playoff implications. So we're going to see what happens. Josh going to pitchfork this one in. Crazy is looking to set up and uh, control the clock right now. 
Down 2-0. They're trying to stay a little calm right there. Jenny tries to throw up to Austin. Nice D right there. Oh, there we go. Chip to Aaron. Aaron against John. Nice D by John right there. Aaron's going to chip it a go. Jason's going to jump on this one. That'll be another draw. So we're going to have, I believe, six between four and seven games on tap today. Stream, so don't go anywhere. So we're also going to have a special announcement. I'm just going to do it right now. You are? I'm going to do it right now. And we'll post it later on Facebook. But we're doing Rachel's in the house. Rachel won't be interested in this one. We are going to, on Wednesday, since it's Halloween, any player who come, uh, the, the players who come dressed up in the best costumes or that ball is thrown all the way down or have the best Halloween-themed attire, there are going to be two prizes. One of them might be a Russian Machine Never Breaks commemorative puck. And another one might be entry, free entry into one of the uh, holiday tournaments that's, that we have here in DCHL leagues. So... Make sure you... Ooh, we got Claude up early in the house. He might be doing some extra stream action right now. Doing his thing. See if we can get him on camera for a couple minutes because he got uh, doing his thing right now. Oh, Dimitri to Brian. Nice pass. Yes, we should fix the bleachers. Brian, turn shot. Big save, Pete. Yes. I'm just going to slide over here while we fix the bleachers. Brian turns, shot deflected. And we're back after that quick little hiccup. Ball's loose. Dimitri tries to throw it to the slot. He does. That point's open. Mark Tebow, broken stick, he's got to drop it. And he does, good play on his part. Pass across, Sarah Schenck, misconnection. Mark doing a good job without a stick in DCHL leagues as in the NHL. Oh, that's a, that's just a, that's a play by Dimitri right there. That's an all-star play right there. And that ball's going to be out. Oh, that's, that was beautiful to watch right there. I'm glad we got that one on tape. So, for, it, it looks like a very, you know, inconsequential play but so on that shot Mark broke his stick had to drop it quick to make sure there was no penalty for um, playing with dangerous equipment or whatever you want to call it right now Melissa has it throws it in so what happened was Dimitri noticed the thing you know the, the uh, Mark without a stick handed him his stick to make sure that a defend a defenseman had too many players on red but what happened though yeah, what happened though was Dimitri handed uh, Mark the stick so the defender would have a, uh, you know, a stick to actually do something with. Dimitri was able to kick the ball out. That's just, that's a, a very heads up play right there. That's a, that's a very experienced play right there by Dimitri. And I'm very happy to see it. Major shout outs to him. So, in general, if, if your goalie's without a stick and you're a defenseman, you want to hand it, you know, it's the, the chain of command generally goes goalie, defender, forward. And among forwards, it goes center first and then winger. So if you can, you can hand a stick off to a player who doesn't have one who's a little more important defensively, that's, a, that's just, I'm, I'm blown away right now. That's, that made my day. I'm glad we got this on stream. That's a good, good teaching experience for a lot of players there. And it's, that's going to be frozen right there. I mean, that, that situation like that doesn't happen very often. Maybe, you know, we'll see maybe once a season, you know, I mean, per team maybe. Your sticks don't break that often. So, the, oh, that's a shot by Aaron. That ball's loose. So, we're going to get back to the game right now. I'm just gushing over that play. Sam, backhand, glove by Stitch. Even though it's going wide, it's Stitch with a nice little action right there. Claude, you want to get in on this? Well, what, what? All right, Claude's going to wait till next game because he's going to be streaming Shangri-La against Stick Magnets. Stick Magnets got a late, last-minute goalie signing for the game. Oh, big shot. Claude, you're going to call me in net, so you better be, you better be nice. You're good, a lot of shout-outs. Yeah. <laughs> And that will be the end of the first period. Oh yeah, we, we can just plug, the, uh, plug it in, like we did for... We need it. We should grab it at some point. <clears throat> but that's going to be... Yeah. That's going to be 2 nothing. High rollers at the end of the first right now. We don't, we don't need it now. We can always jump into Suds' phone. 
So Crazy Eats have had a hard time figuring out this high rollers offense right now. Sales trying to, trying to, Sales tr trying to rally his team right now. He wants to know if. I agree with the, the passion of Sale, but I disagree with his logic here. If they, he's saying if they beat High Rollers, they might be able to play Shangri La next week. And who do you want to play? I mean, I feel, I feel like if you beat High Rollers this week, you want to play them next week because you got their number and you're already fresh in their heads. <laughs> So Salman, I love the passion. I don't, I don't know if I uh, agree with the message. <laughs> oh man! Penalty will expire 13:51 right now. <clears throat> they got Drew, Melissa, Carolyn, and John out there to kill us. Penalty for the high rollers right now. Looks like we see Sam, Aaron, Sarah, Josh, and Becca right now. Aaron's gonna throw it into Sam. Sam looking to make a play, centering pass to Aaron, misconnection. Drew's gonna try to chip it out. Sam's gonna end up with it though. Dumps it down low to Aaron, looking to cycle. Broken up by Carolyn, nice play on her part. Sam looking to throw it around, hits Aaron. Aaron turns shot, big save, Stitch. That ball's still loose and Stitch is gonna jump on it. Abdul's in the house, but will he be around later on today for his Gwendolyn Gladiators game against the First Ladies? Drew's gonna try to clear up, ends up on Becca stick. Becca turns shot, just steered wide by Stitch. Sam and Carolyn battling for it. Drew's gonna dump that one out. It's gonna go all the way down. Becca's gonna turn and carry. Pass across to Alec. Alex gonna chip this one in and go. Gain the zone. Sending pass to Aaron. Shot broken up by John. Shot by Aaron. Excuse me, shot by Alec again. Alex doing a good job getting in the zone like that. I was a big fan of uh, you gain his own, draw a defender, and then try to throw it across. Aubrey Keach comes out of the box right now. They're off. Alex gonna get to, Alex got a lot of space. I would like to see him carry that there, but John's gonna throw it across to Aubrey. Aubrey's gonna gain his own, looking to set up. <clears throat> Aubrey centering pass to Jenny, battling for it. Nice D though. Oh, nice keep in by Mark. Shot. It's a foot, shot by Austin and in! Goal, Austin Keats right there. Huge keep in from Mark. The shot wasn't particularly amazing. It might be because he's uh, using a different stick right now. He has to readjust, but huge keep in. Nice shot on, uh, nice shot that was um, deflected, hits Austin. And that's gonna be a three nothing high rollers right now. Crazy eights are flummoxed. Ball's up and in. Mark's trying to battle for it. Alex battling for it. Austin's gonna get it again. Austin's gonna throw it over to Aubrey. Ball's chipped back and forth. Josh gonna throw it across to Alec. Alec throws it in, looking to create some chaos right there, and he does. Frank gets it, tries to centering pass, broken up. Ball's in again. Frank AG looking to set up. Centering pass broken up by Austin. And that's gonna go all the way down, but that will not be an icing. <clears throat> Austin covered a lot of ground right there to keep it in. Alec tries to get it out. It's still in, though. <clears throat> we got a trip. Sharon, two minutes on the trip here. Things have what? Things, things have gone from bad to worse here for the Crazy Eights. High Roller's got a goal from Austin Keach in it. It's 11 minutes left in the third right now. Excuse me, in the second. 11 minutes left in the second. Three nothing, High Rollers. <clears throat> now I feel like, I feel like Crazy Eights can get back in this one, but I feel like a goal by High Rollers is gonna end it right now. It's never over till it's over, but this is a situation where you got Drew, Dimitri out here, and Brian. You got Brian at the point. Elsa Rapp throws it in. Possibly could throw it across to Brian, not sure though. Brian scores those goals. Oh, that's a nice play by Sam. Huge play. Hits Drew. Drew. Shot. That's going to not go out. It's going to go all the way out right there. Stitch is going to chip it across to Allison. Allison to Brian. I kind of like Brian at the point right now. Look from the turn and shoot. Oh, nice pass across right there. Sam's going to get to this one. Oh, nice play to Dimitri. Dimitri unable to get a stick on it. Sale with the ball. Tries to alley-oop it out. But alley-wrap. Unable to get a thing on it. 
Sam, excuse me, Aaron Brown, turn shot, big save stitch, second save stitch. <clears throat> That's why it's important to make sure you keep that ball in because the biggest chance to, to get a shorthanded goal is a breakaway like that. Aaron had a chance, but Stitcher comes up big. A goal there would have definitely turned the tides right now. Drew's looking to carry, make a play here. He's going to throw it in. Sam throws it across. Oh, my God, hits Brian. What a sick pass. Brian turns, shot, broken up. That ball's loose. That was a sick pass by Sam, though. Kept in by Brian. Brian hits Dimitri, looking to make a play here. Contested. Kept in right now. Attempted clear, broken up. And it's going to get out, though. High roller's getting a chance or two, but Crazy Eights are getting a couple on the short, short-handed side. Definitely not ready to stream this game, folks. I need my, I need about another three hours to wake up, but we're doing what we can here. You need a lot of water. Brian gains his own, pulls it back. Nice little play right there. Pass across to Sam. Nice. Sam tries to center it. Sam, nice stick work there, but Sam keeps control. Pass to Dimitri. Shot and goal. <clears throat> Wait, no goal. <clears throat> oh, missed the net. No goal. Crazy Eights thought it was. Uh, Crazy Eights thought it was in. High Rollers thought it was in. But we're all wrong on this one. Crazy Eights. A lot of, a lot of scary plays here for the Eights. If they're able to just respond though and get one, I think this tide will turn. Sail with the ball. Tries to pitch fork it out. Sam tries to pitch fork it out. That kept in by Carolyn, but Sam has it. Looking to make a play here. Chipped in. Sarah Shank's going to get it. Centering pass. Tries to hit Aaron, but unable to connect. Sam looking to make a play. Nice D by John right there. John throws it up to Dennis. Dennis loses it. Spin move on his part, though. Gets the zone. Two on one. Three on one. Dennis has it. Tries to center. Broken up by Josh. Becker with the ball, looking to make a play here, three on two. Little misconnection here. Sarah and Frank, gonna vortex. Frank's gonna get this one, Sarah's gonna pull up the high boards. Nice pass across. Broken up by Melissa though. Sam ends up with it. Carries, makes to make a play. Shot, save, stitch. He's gonna bat it out. <clears throat> Sam making a move against Austin here. Him and John swarming. Sam will not let him make a play here. Carolyn's going to try to get it out. Josh able to keep it, unable to keep it in. <clears throat> Once he's got some time here, I'd like to see her be a little more patient. Throws it in. Hits Dennis. Has a play right now. Dennis wipes out. He needs some snow tires here. Sam goes to Kept to the outside, though. Looking to set up. Josh has it. Centering pass. That ball's ticked on net, and Stitch is going to jump on it. Six and a half left here, three, nothing. High rollers. Goals by, who scored? I believe Dimitri had one, Austin Keach had one, and I forget the third. Gonna have to double check on that. Aaron Brown shot, that ball's up over the net. Aaron, ball's loose in the slot. Sharon, it's still battling, Sharon's battling for it. Big scrum there, Alec takes it, shot broken up, shot again. Up and in! Sharon to Alec to Aaron. Huge goal for the Crazy Eights. We are back in business. <clears throat> Stitch a lost his stick right there, and as we talked about earlier, you gotta make sure your goalie has a stick right there. That was a nice, just, um, nice way to hit um, Aaron at the side of the net. Easy tapping right there. Kellyanne's going to throw it in. Allison Rapp's going to try to go for it. Alec is already there. Looking to make a play here. Looking to hit Aaron Brown with three defenders there. Collapse on that pass. The explosiveness of Alec has to scare the, scare the high rollers right now. Aaron looking to roll out. Hits Alec. Misconnection though. Brian's going to gather it up. Nice little play to reset. Throws it across to Dimitri, but kept in. That ball's thrown all the way down, will not go for a nice. Thanks for joining us here at the DCHL League's extra production here. 
Jenny O's shot just rolls through the crease, unable to get a stick on it is Brian. Brian looking to roll out. As it, oh, he's got space looking to shoot. Nice break up by Kelly Ann. He still has it though. Brian shot again. That ball's loose. Dimitri's gonna go for the ball, looking to move towards the net again. Both both forwards are covered here. Look for Jenny O to make a move. Nice little rotation on her part. Past Allison Rapp, shot on net. Brian's gonna gather this one up. High roll is really putting uh, putting the offense's own pressure. Dimitri shot, shot up and over. Jenny's gonna gather it up. Centering pass to Dimitri. Hit a foot, centering again. Alex can get this one up though. Look for Alec to pass to Aaron, moving. Tries to do so, and he does get there. That ball's up and over. Josh gonna set up, looking to make a play here. Throwing to, throwing to Sharon right now. Sharon and Allison going for it. Allison's gonna get there, but Sharon with a strong forecheck takes it. Centering pass. Aaron Brown with the ball. Shot goal! <clears throat> Aaron beats Jason five hole. That's all Sharon right there to, to get, never give up on that plate. It's a strong, strong four check right there. Able to get the ball and hit Aaron. Aaron from Sharon. Sharon, yeah, she did all the work. <laughs> what Suds doing trying to take away her assist? <clears throat> the eye in the sky will never lie here. Shout out to Sharon for that great play. If Suds don't want to give her credit, we will. We got a 3-2 game here and we are back. Crazy Aids are bringing it. Centering pass broken up. John Trick tries to get it out. Becca tries to keep it in. That ball's out by Austin, uh, excuse me, Aubrey. Too many keeches here for me. That ball's still in, out. Ball picked up by Drew. Drew's just gonna dump it in. That's gonna go on that. Pete's gonna glove it. Nope, Pete's not gonna play it. And that's fine. They're gonna. Oh, see, that's not Pete. That's Ben. Ben Berger's in that. Excuse me. I'm sorry. I... Yeah, it's Ben in that. For some reason, because I mean, Pete's a normal goalie. I, mean, I talked to Ben yesterday and he said he was playing net, and I'm just. God, I'm an idiot. <laughs> but yeah, Ben doing a great job. He's gonna steer this one aside. Uh oh, that hit Becca in the foot. Scary there. That's a compliment to Ben, me thinking he's Pete. John Chick tries to throw it on net. Still ends up with the ball, tries to clear it in. Becca's gonna get it. Sarah's gonna chip it all the way down right now. High roll's gotta make sure they do a good job chasing these players down because the speed of Crazy Eights will cause a problem here. Sam across to Aubrey. Aubrey throws it across to Austin, but Sarah's gonna ice it all the way down. This has been a devastating period here as Crazy Eights have scored two unanswered. Both Aaron Brown, assists from Sharon and Alec on the first one and the second one is assisted just by Sharon right now. This is a big game for both teams as this, this could be third seed action for one of them. Sam Brinker with the ball looking to make a play. Try to take Allison Rapp inside out. He's going he's gonna to get in the outside. Turn shot, unable to hit Aaron. But Aaron with the ball. Josh at the point, wide open. Hits Josh. Turn shot, up and over. And Austin Rapp's going to try to get this, but Sam Brinker's going to get there. Sam cannot wrap it around. Nice pass to Sharon. Turn, unable to get a stick on it. Dennis the menace. Break away. Come on, Dennis. Shot. Big save, man. This is what Dennis does. I love it. Dennis shot again! Oh my god! Allison Rapp's gonna try to keep this one and Sharon's gonna get that ball out. Sharon's playing a great game so far. Ball thrown in, Josh gathers it up. Kept in by Melissa, nice keep. Turns, throws it in, frozen by Ben. That ball's loose though. It is gonna be frozen again. Dennis having a great shift right now. Best she wishes you could have capitalized on that one on stream. <clears throat> 20 seconds left here. We're gonna see if the high rollers are able to get a little more aggressive here and maybe add to their lead. Josh is gonna get it, tries to clear it out. That ball is gonna go all the way down, will not be an icing. Aaron with a strong four check with five seconds left right now. That ball is gonna be 
into neutral zone, and that will be the end of the period right now. 3-2. Three, two, three, three, two high rollers. Crazy H scored too late, so we're going to see what his exciting third period brings. I got a bounce right now, but we're going to have Jess take over on the stream because I got to get ready. I'm playing goalie for Stick Mags next, and this game will be streamed, so make sure you give it a watch and give me some shout-outs, give me some love. over of the camera. So that was an exciting second period. It was, uh, well, High Rollers had a 3 nothing lead, but Crazy Eights came back and scored two in the second. So now it is a one goal game going into the third. Really exciting. Can't wait to see what happens. Both teams doing the their little meet. Ooh, we're going to see a huddle. Crazy Eights. Now, they were in the rec division last season, and this is their first season in D4, so they've had a, a couple growing pains, but they've done pretty well so far. If they win this game, they have the potential to be all the way up to the third seed, but they've got to come back first. All right, for the faceoff, we got Sam Brinker versus Dimitri. High rollers are saying they need another girl. Only have four players out right now. They still gotta fix the clock too. All right, here we go. Suds is coming into the face-off circle. Time to see some third period stuff. Sam doing a little basketball. Battle behind the net. High rollers are gonna carry it out, it looks like. Up the boards to Brian. Brian passing it, but they're offside, so they gotta reset. Becca in the corner now. She can take her time with it. Becca up the boards. Falls a little bit back and forth here. Dimitri has it. Dimitri with the shot, that stops. Crazy has got it out. Allison's gonna try to play forward. Some back and forth right now. Frank didn't quite get through. Becca up the boards. Ball's kind of right beneath us. It's in the worst spot, so. You know the usual ball along the boards and back and forth between both teams. Haven't really seen any uh, Zone time yet, it's only about a minute into the third. Any zone time this period. All right, so another face off. One back by Crazy Aids. It's along the boards. Oh, it's over here now. Sal up to Sarah. Sarah chips it in. John Chick is going to gather that up. He passes it up the boards. It hits Sal, so it's not an icing. Becca has it in the corner. Brian with some light pressure. Becca up the boards. Ball goes all the way down. It looks like I think it hit some players, so that's not nice. And Allison trying to play it up. Crazy Eights has some zone time now. Shot right there. I think that's Alec. Aaron to Alec with a shot. Jason makes the save, and there's a face off in the high roller zone. Good work by Crazy Eights so far coming back. They need one more goal to tie it up. They were down three nothing. And they scored two in the second. Balls played back. Josh with a shot that goes wide. Sharon battling with Carolyn. Kept in. Not sure who's down there. I think it's Kelly Ann has the ball. Oh, I think it hit the netting. All right, we'll have a, uh, I think it stays in the zone if I heard Suds correctly. So you have another face-off. Suds is down there talking to people. All right. John trying to get it out. Sam trying to get it out. Carolyn trying to get it out. And I think that'll go stick. Wow. 
Crazy Aids have it. Shot! Aaron with the shot, it goes in! I hope I had that on camera. I was trying to follow the ball, but it's a tight game, everybody. That's insane! Oh man, I really hope I got that. So uh, that's great. Good job for Crazy Aids so far. High rollers, they'll probably. All right, the goal was by Aaron. Assist from Sharon and Kelly Ann. Well done, Crazy Aids. Alec kicking it forward. Frank has it in the corner. He's looking in front. John is there. John tries to get it out, but Alec is able to get it. Carolyn plays the ball behind the net for John. Sarah tied him up. Frank gets the ball. And it's a goal! Frank! Frank just backhands it. I think he was trying to pass it, but the angle was right that it went in, and I don't think Jason expected that. So that is crazy eight four unanswered goals to take the lead away from high rollers right now. We have a 4-3 game, folks. Well done by Frank. And uh, high rollers took their time out. They gotta figure out, well, hey, what happened? Why, why is this happening? We gotta tighten it up. Crazy Aid's kind of on a high right now. It's really exciting to have a comeback like that. But this game is far from over, folks. All right. High roll or Crazy Aids win it back. Josh takes it, plays it up. But uh, I think Melissa was there. She was able to get it. Allison up the boards. Dennis offside, unfortunately. Four high rollers. Try to be unbiased. It is a hell of a game so far. And the comeback that Crazy Aids have is amazing. I love to see teams that don't give up. Sometimes if you're down three nothing, you're kind of just like, oh no, you know? But, uh, you know, never give up, you never know. One, two quick goals and the game's in your favor again. All right. All right behind us. Allison playing it up the board. Becca playing it up. Gather up by high rollers. Josh up to Sarah. High rollers getting it out. Dennis is there. He brings it down. He throws it in front. And Ben Berger is going to cover that up. Been playing in net for Crazy Eights. He normally plays out, but he's been, I hear he's been trying his hand at goalie and is doing him pretty well at it. So kudos to Ben. All right. Face off in the Crazy Eights zone. Got Sam against Dimitri. For uh, high rollers, we have Dimitri, Brian, looks like Jenny, Carolyn. In the corner. Goes all the way down. Not an icing. Jason comes out to play it. Oh my gosh. In front of his own net. That could have been dangerous. Aaron curling. That shot's deflected up. Sam has it now. Sam to the front of the net. Ball is in the corner. Aaron's going to retrieve it. Aaron looking for a pass. Trying to get it through to Sam. High Roller trying to get this ball out. Kelly keeps it in. And there is a face off. All right. So it is. Aaron gathers ball up, throws it in front. Sharon almost got it, but Carolyn with a great defensive play with the poke check. Ball goes out. Sam
Sam's gathering it up. He pressed to play forward, but Dimitri has it. Dimitri up the boards, pushed away by Sal. Aaron and John battling for the ball. John couldn't quite get, through, get the ball out. A lot of uh, people trying to get the ball right there in front of the, <laughs> the high rollers net. Sharon with the shot. High rollers play, players are trying to muddy up the middle so they don't have a chance. Sharon getting it to Aaron. Aaron sh shot blocked. Aaron another attempt to Sam. Sam backhands it. Jason stops it. Carolyn cradles the ball and it is safely covered. And we were going to have another face off. I think, I mean, if you're the high rollers, that's the line of the crazy eights. It's probably the most dangerous when you have Aaron and Sam out there together and Sharon. Like the chemistry of that line was just insane. So I think, um, they did a good job, you know, not letting them get any shots through, not any, I mean, there were some shots, Jason obviously didn't stop it, but the quality shots were not there because they were tied up, so now High Rollers got to push themselves if they want to come back. John pushing it forward, Sarah with a shot, ooh, that was close. Balls one back. Josh with a shot. Frank is going to pick that up. He's trying to get it through. Oh, what a pass. Frank to Alec, but that ball goes wide. Sarah has it now. She's curling, trying to find the middle to Frank. Frank couldn't quite get his stick on it. Becca cuts in. Becca with a shot blocked by Allison. Frank in the corner now. Frank playing it behind the net. Ball's back in the corner. Dimitri's trying to take it out. Dimitri up the board. Ball's not in yet. Ball's in. Dimitri with a shot. Is that in? No, it's a save. It looked like it was in. Great save by Ben. All right, so now High Rollers have a chance in the zone. There's four minutes left in the game. It's 4-3 in favor of Crazy 8s. Crazy 8s were down 3 nothing. Came back, got four unanswered goals to take the lead. Paul's played forward. Sharon has it. Sharon. Aaron trying to get it out. High rollers with some shots. Kellyanne playing it up to Sharon. Sharon playing the ball forward. Aaron's going to get that. Aaron with the ball in the corner. The high rollers pressuring. Aaron to Kelly. Kelly with a shot. Sharon putting some pressure on in the corner to the high rollers. High rollers playing the ball forward. Sammy to gets it. The ball goes out. Aubrey now. Oh no. Allison up to Aubrey. Ball's in the corner. Aaron's gonna get this though. So crazy eight. Definitely feel like this has been the second and third period has belonged to them this this game. Great response by them. Josh with the shot. Picked up by high rollers though. They're gonna try to get it out of the zone. Becca pinches in to keep it in. Ball's in the corner. Sharon has it. She's looking for a pass. Ball's out of the zone now. A little bit of back and forth. Allison to Melissa. Ball's in. Ball goes in the corner. Becca has it. Becca trying to play it up. Dennis. John has it now. John with a shot. Stopped by Sal. Melissa, great pressure. Melissa or Sammy, I'm not sure which one. But one of them, really good pressure. Thank you. All right. 
We've got John setting it up, laying it up the board. Pressure from the high rollers on Sal. What a four check. It's a loose ball. Dimitri with a shot. That goes wide. Really great forechecking and force that turnover there. High rollers need a goal if they want to tie. About a minute left. Ball goes out. Carolyn's going to retrieve it. Carolyn pushes it back into. Offsides call. Clock will stop when it's under a minute, so it looks like someone needs to get the clock and stop it. That'll reset to a minute. But um, it is a one goal game. High rollers have pulled their goalie. And we'll have a face off in the neutral zone. This is a must score chance the high rollers need. Carolyn. Playing it behind the net to John. John playing it forward to Jenny. Kelly trying to get it. Brian has it now. Brian shooting. That gets blocked. Sam has it. Stolen by Dimitri. Dimitri getting it through. There's 37 seconds left, folks. There's an empty net for the high rollers. Dimitri to Jenny. She couldn't get a stick on it. Ball is going to be played out. By Crazy Ace, John's gonna gather that up. John pushing it forward, but Sam has it. Sam trying to backhand it. Brian now. Ball's right here. Ball can't quite get the ball in the zone. There's only 10 seconds left. Carolyn with a shot. It's frozen, they stopped it. That's actually great decision making. Now they have five seconds. Before it was 10 seconds neutral zone, you don't know what happens. Shot, goalie saves it, clock stops. They have five seconds left, and they can score. You know, five seconds means something. So let's see what happens. All right. Looks like it'll probably be killed off by Crazy Eights in the corner. Crazy Eights are the winners of this game, folks. What an exciting comeback. Great job to them. And thank you for tuning in.